Alrighty guys, welcome to another video. I'm going to be doing a unboxing of package. Not a big fan of unboxing videos. This might be, might be my only one on the account of I don't like packages. Uh, I like opening packages and getting presents, but I don't like packing materials, cardboard boxes, or like packing peanuts. They stick to everything. Well, anyways, this is my first official unboxing video, and got this package from Film, for, uh, Film Photography Project. They also do the Film Photography Podcast, one of my favorite podcasts, and their Flickr group is extremely helpful. Um, so, yep, this one shipped from New Jersey, I believe. Yep, Butler, New Jersey. I know there's, that's where the FPP podcast is from, as well as, I believe there's a great uh, used video game store in Butler. That might be it. But let me go ahead and start opening this. I bought one of the FPP debonair cameras from the store. So let's see what everything looks like. Oh shit, check that out. So got myself a Polaroid of Mike Rosso holding a, looks like a debonair. Yep, it is. That's a cool little gift. There we go. I think I should send something back to him. Here's the debonair camera and some more extras. Do do do. Oh, cool. That is. I'm trying to see. I don't know who that is. Well, it is experimental, uh, impossible film. It looks like Matt. Something. Oh, it says happy shooting with their name on it. Is that Matt? Rash? I don't know. Anyways, moving on. Got a sticker. Same sticker that's up here. Do do do. Um, the FPP store. This is just a printed photo of what they sell. That's kind of cool. Another sticker. Bam. Do do do. Looks like a big newsletter. I got two of them. So do do do. What is a film photography podcast? This nice little newsletter. That'd be cool if I got one of these every week or month. Here's another copy of the same thing. And it's all my info. So that's in, that's all that's in the box. Thank God it didn't come with packaging peanuts. It came with a little poppy paper. So let's go ahead and unbox the camera. This is the debonair, which is a different version of the Holga Diana type cameras. The hell do you open this? There you go. It smells like the 70s. So here it is. Got the top open. Here's the sides. Take 16 pictures in color, black or white film, or color or black or white on 120 film. Oop! Yay! Got a roll of 120 film, which is awesome. I was not expecting that. Here's the camera, inside plastic. Throw that in the box. Whoa, more stuff. Uh, here's a hand strap. The debonair instructions. And do do do. Oh, nice. A mailer for the dark room. It's actually a good website. They um, do 120 film, and they also do, I believe, 116 film. I might be wrong. Um, they they can scan sprockets and develop sprocket holes for you if you're into sprocket hole photography. I've used them once for that, and then after that, I learned how to develop film on my own. So that's pretty cool that they're endorsing the dark room. I really like that. So that's the dark room. This is Portra right there. 120 film. Portra is really nice Kodak color film. It's cheap and it looks good. I have no complaints against it. Um, here's the instruction manual. Very basic. Has a winding knob, viewfinder, shutter lens, shutter release. And that's pretty much it. Do do do. 
how to use the camera. Well, I don't think I need instructions on how to use the 120 film camera. Anyways, here's the camera. Yeah, let me get in there. That's what the camera looks like. Comes with a lens cap. And it is at does this move? Yep. Oh, that's the distance scaler. This is how you focus. Although I don't know where the... Ah, there's a little tiny line. You can barely see it. So, that's for portrait. Group shot. Infinity. Ooh, shutter sounds really cool. Uh, looks like a cold shoe or a hot shoe. Oh, maybe it is a hot shoe. And... How do you open this? Ah, there's a little switch on the bottom, and the door should slide off, am I right? Yep. There you go. And, what is this up here? Get in focus. Aha. It's a flash, and no flash. Damn, the shutter's intense. And that seems to be pretty much it. I don't see a setting for bulb or anything. So. It's very light. Here's look through the viewfinder. Nothing too special. I am going to put a little squirt of uh, WD-40 in. In this wheel, it's very squeaky. It's high pitched. I don't know if you can hear it, but it sounds like a mouse or a, some bird tweet in my ear. So, anyways, this is the camera. Debonair it has the Film Photography Podcast logo on it. Uh, I like how it says Plastic Film Camera 120. Debonair right down here. And it's an F8 lens. And that's pretty much it. Let me see if there's if that controls the aperture. Nope, looks like just one aperture setting. So let's put the back door back on. And I guess lock this way. Yep. There's a little window. Actually that window is kinda big. It's pretty nice. Yeah, I gotta put a little WD forty on that and it'll be perfect. There you go, guys. This is the FPP Debonair. Quick unboxing for you. And a quick overview. It's really nice. I never had a package from a, the FPP store, so it's pretty cool. Got some Polaroids. And I believe their address is still on here. Yeah. Their address is still on there. I might ship something back to them as a thank you. So, And the camera was $20. And... That's my uh, little unboxing. So, guys, please subscribe and enjoy. Ooh, I like how this camera strap is. Put that in focus. Very easy camera strap to put on. Bam. I don't like camera straps that are attached to uh, keychains. It's very simple. So, you can put on this side or this side. And that's pretty much it for the camera. So, again, is this was my unboxing of an FPP Debonair, as well as the package. So, this is pretty cool. I'm gonna add this to my collection. Nice, nice Polaroids. The box I'll probably keep and hide somewhere for years. That's the box again. All right, I guess. Well, thank you for watching, and happy collecting.